Imagine you went swimming and is caught by a hungry shark. What were you going to do? Can you swim faster than a shark? In the story, Peppy fought against the shark by grabbing its nose tightly and swinging it in the air and throwing it. But I won't wear this toy because it's illegal in my house. He Peppy long something. Okay, Astrid Ling Green. How can I never get this? I wrote 13 of books for children. She wrote the story about Pippi. I put it up in the picture. She wrote stories about Pippi, a free spirited red haired girl, to entertain her own daughter, which was sadly sick. is a red haired no a girl with flaming red hair she was a princess and traveled to the uk living by herself he's brave and saved people from the shops second tommy and anika they are brother and sister and friends of peppy they are um, they all went to school. They liked swimming where they met the shark. And also, they persuaded her to go to school. Peppy was born a princess on a small island. Island kingdom. But she left her family to the UK with her friends. And with her two best with her two pets a horse and a monkey the monkey can even wear clothes look at all my hand she um she made friends with tommy and anika who persuaded her to go to school together as i said as they all went swimming Pippi invited her friends to the island. One morning when they were swimming in the sea, they met a big shark. While all the other people were frightened, Pippi was brave enough to rescue her friend Tommy. This is an interesting story. Lots of things happened to Pippi on her way aboard, abroad. She made friends as she was open minded and confident. Her monkey even wears clothes like a human being. I like this story and recommend it to you for a nice reading. And I learned that help will come to you when danger comes as long as you have perseverance and hope. I like it and I give it a sure five stars. Bye bye.